Adjustment layers let you edit light, color, and tone without permanently changing your original image. You can apply them individually or combine them for more complex effects. And just like other layer types, they can be organized and edited. You can also control exactly where they're applied, either globally to your entire image or selectively to individual elements. You can edit them at any time or simply turn them off. Let's use some adjustment layers to amp up the colors in my self-portrait. To start, I'll boost the color saturation of my entire image. In Adjust, I'll select Adjustment Layers and then Hue and Saturation. I'll use the sliders to increase the overall saturation of the colors. Then I'll select just the blues because I want an extra boost of the color of my costume and I'll play with the sliders until it looks just right. There, it's looking more lively. Here it is in the layer stack right on top of my image. Adjustment layers always sit above the layer they affect. You can always re-edit an adjustment layer. Just tap Hue and Saturation from the bottom menu, then adjust the sliders however you like. Next, I want to give the image more depth. I'm going to do this with the Brightness and Contrast Adjustment Layer. Here I can adjust the amount of light and contrast between the light and dark areas. There are subtle changes that lift the whole image. Remember, everything I'm doing is non-destructive, meaning these changes aren't affecting my original image. I can use the eye icon next to each layer to turn them off and compare. It's looking great so far, but it feels like it needs one last touch. I want the flowers to be a better match for my color palette, so I'll add an adjustment to just that spot. To make a selective adjustment, I'll first select the flower and then go to Adjust and Adjustment Layers, where I can choose another hue and saturation layer. This time, the adjustment will only apply to the area I have selected, so I can change the hue of my flowers without affecting the rest of my image. Now the flower complements the portrait and everything feels more unified. That's the beauty of adjustment layers. They're flexible. I can play around with color, lighting, and tone, all without touching the original image. 